All right, Coach, a short work week. How's the team looking heading into the big game against Winnipeg? Yeah, you're right. It is a short week. We played Saturday, traveled home, and then we're going to travel back to Winnipeg on Wednesday to play Thursday. And uh, the guys are excited. You know, we have we have big games. We're playing the four West teams, the other teams four in a row right now. And so this is uh, Winnipeg coming up. It's going to be a tough game, but we'll be ready. How confident is the team at this stage? Uh, six and one. Obviously, the record's great. It's performing well on the on the field as well. How confident is it, is the group? Yeah, the the thing I like about them is they they've been really good about living in the moment, and just literally one game at a time. And I think that's all we're thinking about right now is to get ready to go play in Winnipeg. And when when we get when we're prepared and we're ready to go, which our guys have been doing, we're a, we're a tough team. And that's all we're trying to do is focus on Winnipeg, try to go there and get a win. Uh, yeah, prepared and ready with the backup quarterback as well. What's the status of, of Vernon Adams going into Thursday's game? So we are the same scenario as last week as Dane's going to be the starter. Um, Dom Davis will be number two and Vernon will be the emergency three. And uh, Vernon's coming along, which is good. It's just this is such a short week. Uh, we want to give him one more. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised at all if he's ready for the next one. Um, just how things are going. And as far as protection goes for the quarterback, uh, the loud sacks five in each of the last two games, is that an area of concern at this stage or is this something you could easily fix, you think? Yeah, I mean, it, that's a function of everybody and there's lots of things we can be better at. I always tell our guys the, the good news, bad news on not playing our best. The, the bad news is that we're not playing our best. The good news is we can still win and have things to get better at. And, uh, and so that's a function of everybody on offense. Uh, if you have any protection issues, it could be the O-line, could be the running back. Could be the QB not getting the ball out on time, or receiver not running his route correct correctly. All those teams. It's also, they pay the other guys on the other team too to make some plays. So, lots of things to get better at, and uh, you know we'll keep working at it. On that side of things, though, is there one particular area that you feel like you could improve, or is it? Um, I'm always the head coach. I'm always harping on the penalty thing of being low on the penalties. We've we've played a couple teams this year where the other team took a lot of penalties, and I think our guys are understanding that firsthand now. Is that when we when we limit the negative football which that includes penalties you know when we're not going backwards uh, we do a lot of good things so uh, we're always uh, we're always trying to stay on top of that all right now to the good news defensively very strong uh, under 100 points allowed so far this season what, what's been the reason behind that yeah I've, I'm sticking to my stories it's a strength and numbers operation and that it's all all 12 guys on the field and it's our whole coaching staff working together and um, that's how I really view it. Is we don't have a lot of we don't really have weak links. We're we're performing uh, well together, and uh, um, you know we're just really proud of the whole the whole group, the 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 players and the coaches. Is there a number particularly you want to keep Winnipeg under coming into that game? We're, our mindset is that we got one more point than them at the end of the game, then 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 we're good to go. And you never know in pro football. The, you know we have to be able to win different styles of games, whether that's low scoring, high scoring, whatever whatever the game looks like. We just want to have one more than the other team. And um, you know they they got a lot of good players that are explosive, and uh, we're gonna have to play really well on defense in order to win this game. Where are we at on rhymes? Should be playing. Yeah, we fully expect him to play. What does he bring? What is he? How much better does does he make the offense? She's, oh, he's a he's a really good player for us. So big target, and I know he's hungry. Um, and uh, you know we're hoping that 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 week, he had that extra week to to get healthy and feel like himself again. And uh, obviously, anytime he's in our lineup, we're excited about it. How excited are you to get the full group back at some point? You've you've hardly had them. Yeah, you're right. It's been it hasn't been like we've drawn it up, but the good news is we've had good depth and we've had uh, people step in, and that's that's part of the deal. Is you're when you go through a long season, is there's going to be uh, times where people are out, and we need other people to step in and still get the job done, which they they've been doing.